Kara, today was first practice for this national team training camp. Uh, what was the goal? Did you guys accomplish the goal? Um, I, I think the goal, you know, what Coach talked about is just to get better every day, um, to use the practices um, as, a, as an opportunity to grow together, to learn each other's games, um, to learn the system better. We don't have a lot of time, you know, other, other national teams have been practicing for months, so we have to take advantage of every day that we're here and um, try and build uh, toward, toward the World Championships, which is coming up really fast. I mean, it's coming in, in a little less than three weeks. Uh, you're one of two 2008 Olympians in the gym right now. Uh, what's it feel like? Does this feel like a team that's on its way to a gold medal, or is it comparable? It's a different coach, different system. I, it just feels different, you know, mm -hmm. because of, of what you said. Different coach, different system, and then a lot of new players. Yep. You know, a lot of young players that, um, you know, haven't experienced yet uh, what it takes to, to win internationally. And, and so, um, you know, you just try to, to be a good veteran, uh, to play hard, and um, you kind of know what's coming ahead, you know. So I think that, that gives you a little bit of advantage, having been down that road. You know the way that you have to play against these international teams. It's different than WNBA. It's uh, different than probably anything else you've played before. But um, you got to be ready to be physical, to be tough, and, and uh, you know, to make good plays. What's your focus to make the eventual final 12-man roster? What do you think you need to do? Um... I think it's just a matter of how, how hard you play and um, how smart you play, uh, really. I, I think I pride myself in, in being a player that works hard every day in practice, um, want to make smart plays on the court. Um, I think I have good versatility. I think I can play both guard spots. And in our in, uh, Coach Oriama system, you got to be able to uh, play multiple spots because sometimes you come down with the basketball and the outlet and you're playing one. Sometimes you're running on the wing and, and you're playing a wing. So you got to kind of be able to pick things up quickly and understand the offense for multiple spots on the floor. Switching gears just a little, have you seen any of the men's world championship play? Uh, yeah. uh, maybe Brazil game was a great game. Mm -hmm. How do you think they're playing as a team? And is, uh, can you give me some thoughts on the men? Uh, you know, I think they're 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 getting better every game that they play. Um, the thing that uh, that it, I won't say has been funny, but you, you can tell the difference between NBA and international, especially on the perimeter. Yeah. Uh, you know, you see a lot of those guards driving in, and they're getting hacked would be a foul in the NBA, which would be a foul in the WNBA, but internationally it's not a foul. So um, seeing their adjustment, because they are a younger team with a lot of new guys, uh, to the referees and to the calls and to the um, environments over there, um, I, I think they've improved a ton from, from their exhibitions until now. But, you know, we'll see how it goes. Now they're in the elimination round, and, and you know, those, those are the games that, that you have to win. Speaking of adjustments, the travel call is another one they've been struggling with. Have you guys looked at that at all, or have you personally looked at what they're calling as a travel that has uh, caught up some of our guys in the early preliminary round? Um, I've never really had a problem with that internationally. Okay. You know, just put the ball down before you move your feet. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, sometimes in, 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 uh, over here you kind of move your feet before you put the ball down a little bit. So, But um, I've never really had a problem with that traveling. Great. Thank you, Kara.